Good morning and welcome to Tate Farm. This morning I'm going to share with you the story of Shrub, which was our original product that we began making uh, just about 34 years ago. And Shrub is an old colonial drink actually brought to America by the English colonists and it was a way of preserving sort of perishable, delicate summer fruits and uh, so they would remain stable and could be enjoyed during the winter months. So essentially it's a process of taking fresh fruits and preserving them in vinegar. And vinegar is a great carrier to extract all the beautiful flavor that comes through with the fruits. And then it's very stable because it's very acidic and then it becomes sort of the base of making great drinks. We have been making raspberry shrub now for just about 34 years. We had a pick your own raspberry operation. It was the height of the season, thousands of pounds of berries on the canes, and it started to rain. And as once in a while happens here in central Pennsylvania, a cloud just hangs over the valley and it rains and it rains and it rains. And so instead of losing all the berries, because Raspberries are very perishable and very quick to mold if they get too moist in there in the plantings. We decided to hire pickers and pick thousands of pounds of raspberries, thinking we'd find a market for them in the uh, winter time. Well, we didn't find a market, but our dear family friend and head product development person, Cindy Law, reminded David Tate of an old Mennonite drink she had once made called Raspberry Shrub. Betty Groff was a Lancaster County Mennonite who had a restaurant and a cookbook and she had a recipe in there for raspberry shrub and Cindy resurrected that recipe and gave it to David Tate and said, hey, maybe you should think about making this raspberry shrub, taking all those raspberries, putting them in vinegar, letting them infuse for at least a month, taking them out, getting a beautiful raspberry vinegar, adding sugar and creating a concentrate that then would be shelf stable and people could have it and then add carbonated water to, seltzer, um, ginger ale, lemonade, whatever they wanted. So that was the beginning of Shrub. It started here on the farm, being made in David's kitchen. Then we converted the old milking parlor to the shrubbery, bought some old pasteurizing equipment. So the first bottles of Raspberry Shrub, here's our first label with uh, made with black magic marker and um, were made in 1986. We took it to the farmer's market. We served it to people who were out here to pick berries and can, can have mixed reviews. Vinegar, drinking vinegar can seem like it's a little bit odd, but it's super refreshing, particularly in the summer. So we looked to some sort of vintage uh, clip art images. And these are, this is an image of haymakers out in the field. These sorts of drinks were used a lot to quench the thirst of people working out in the agricultural fields because it's hot, but vinegar and sugar and raspberries has the ability to sort of rehydrate the body, kind of like the original Gatorade. So mixed with water, it was a very refreshing drink. And then a few years later, we upgraded again to a new motif, again, that same sort of vintage look of working out in the fields, pastoral, historic, you know, sort of harkens you back to an earlier time. Still the same product, still the same great concentrate. And then just a few years back, we decided that maybe we needed to be a little more literal. And so we looked for some vintage fruit crate labels that actually depicted the actual fruit and what it was. And lo and behold, this was our fourth label of raspberry shrub. Same gate product, same ingredients, but just new packaging. 